Hi everybody, my name is Matt Elliott and I'm with Guarantee RV Supercenters here today to show you a brand new trailer that we just got in. This is a Jayco Whitehawk and it's called a 23 MRB and it's a fantastic floor plan. I'm, I'm just going to show it to you because there's a lot to talk about. Follow me. One thing you notice right away when you open the Jayco door is that it doesn't slam. It's got some friction to it. And so people can't walk in and out of here and the door is going to be banging open and shut and damaging things and the wind won't catch it. I think that's brilliant. Okay, so now what we've got here is a really open trailer. This is a trailer that has a couch and a dinette and a slide out and a rear bathroom and a queen walk around bed and yet they call it a 23 MRB. It's got an overall length, including the hitch of about 27 feet, but uh, the living space, which would normally be very congested with all that stuff in there, is quite open. So let's just start here with the bathroom and we'll work our way around. This has got a dynamite bathroom. The stool is located so everybody can get their knees right out. It's got a great big shower with a skylight, plenty of room for tall people in here room to turn around and change your clothes. And in fact, we've got a very large wardrobe, lots and lots of hanging storage in here. And it's got, of course, a nice little sink. It's got a medicine cabinet, a towel rack. This is a dynamite bathroom. Normally, when you put a bathroom in the middle of a trailer, it makes everything kind of tight. By putting this one in the back, I can have a bigger bath and still have a more open feeling trailer. Now this has the big eight cubic foot fridge. A lot of trailers you look at have smaller fridges, five or six cubic feet, but this has got a lot of refrigerator space and it's got a really big freezer with a nice deep basin so stuff doesn't come out at you when you travel, it doesn't shift and come out when you open the door. Also, we've got a giant pantry here. You can put a lot of storage items in here and more space here and here. So you're never going to run out of food in this trailer. They even thought up a great way to put a picnic table in. This is a removable table. You can fold it up outside and use it as a picnic table. It's kind of cool. We look at the galley here. We see we've got an oven and a three burner stove and a good amount of counter space and nice big strong high quality drawers with plywood construction and metal drawer guides. There's a whole bank of those and storage back up under the sink there. And this has a really big sink and it's a double sink so you can wash and rinse. That's what people don't realize about a double sink. Got a nice bit of storage here and look at the beautiful cabinets they make. So one of the things that's nice about a Jayco is that these cabinets are all screwed together and that means that they're made out of wood, not particle board or melamine or something like that. And it, it just makes them last a long time. In fact, unlike any other trailer out there, Jayco has a two year bumper to bumper warranty. They cover the trailer and the appliances for two years, and there isn't anybody in the industry that does that. Um, these guys have a real legacy. They've been in this industry for over 50 years. We've been selling them here for quite a while, and they're an outstanding product. They're reliable and they're innovative. Now, if we look over here, we see we've got a home theater system and a TV set, and it's got storage here as well, and that coincides nicely with this horseshoe dining area. Now, this is an extremely versatile deal. That's all storage underneath, and it'll also make a nice big bed by folding down the dinette table, we can complete this bedding area. The other thing that's kind of neat is that's a freestanding table. So here's another thing I can move around. I can put this around in front of the couch. I can move it here, I can take it outside. And if I have some big friends like, big chubby guys like me, I can push that around and it's easy to get in and out. Now the other thing is, this has a couch. So this has a very big social area, and if people are sitting over here in this dining area, that's like a big sectional, really. We've got sofa space here. The TV's located properly for all of the seating. It's not with the kitchen right in the middle, it's over there. And so everybody can be in here and moving around. It's, it's really got a, a good traffic flow and a good comfortable area. But watch this. So what I can do, first of all, notice all the storage under there. Okay, watch this trick. This trailer has a full-size queen Murphy bed. Now, 
I only need a bed at bedtime. Wouldn't it be nice if I had a trailer that maximized all the space? A lot of times your bedroom's secluded off here and behind a wall and it makes the whole trailer feel small and tight inside. And I only really need that when it's time to go to bed. It comes with straps to hold your bedding down and I could just fold that right down. Now if I want, I could leave it that way. But for me, most of the time, I'd rather have this living space back. So that is a dynamite feature in this trailer and it's, it, it's just a real problem solver for people who can't figure out how to get all these features into a trailer with enough storage and small enough to be towable behind their half ton and fit in their little campsites that they like to get. There's also a lot of things to look at outside this trailer. Let's go take a look. So as we go around this trailer, the first thing I want to point out is that it comes with the power tongue jack and it also comes with the big seven and a half gallon propane bottles and I defy you to go through 15 gallons of propane in a single trip. That's just a great supply of propane. Down here we see this little black bib here. This is a connector for a portable solar panel. So if I want I could buy a portable solar panel and I can use it to reinforce my battery supply all day long while I'm out playing and it keeps my batteries topped off and makes them nice and happy and healthy all the time. Well, the other thing that's great is it's not built in, so I don't have to drill holes in my roof, I don't have to pay a guy to put it in there, and now I can take my solar panel down to the boat dock, or I can jump start my truck, or I can charge my phone, I can do whatever I want with a portable solar panel instead of a built-in one. I think it's great. Let's go around this way. We have a power awning, and we have the nice big grab handle here, and you see some good information when you look at this sidewall here. This has a tough shell aluminum frame, and that means that the sidewalls in here are all welded aluminum. It also has what's called a magnum truss roof that is patented. Jayco has really arguably one of the strongest roof structures in the industry. They test it very thoroughly to make sure it's strong, and it helps give the whole coach lots of integrity. This one also has a glacier package. A glacier package is gonna make it so the plumbing isn't likely to freeze up and you're gonna be warmer overall if you like to go cold weather camping. And so that's dynamite. They've also introduced a, a key locks all the same. I know most of you have had a trailer with two doors, find out you've got a lot of extra keys. This one here, the door keys match. You don't have to worry about that. Take a look over here. Notice that the axles are a little bit spread out this gives you a longer wheelbase under your trailer and it makes it ride smoother and it helps manage your hitch weight. Look right here. Now what you have here is you have an outside kitchen. Now most outside kitchens have a little counter space and a sink, but this one also has a two burner stove. There's still the connector for a barbecue, so we can barbecue out here, we can cook on a two burner stove, we've got refrigeration, we've got 110 power supply, We've got hot and cold running water. So this is a lot more complete. One of the other great things about this trailer is that it's got all LED lighting and you can see these LED lights from far, far away, even in the fog. It's very, very good to have those. Now, here's something brand new and exciting. You see this whole deal here? This is called a macerator and this is a sewer system by which I can actually activate a little pump grinder and it'll emulsify everything in my holding tank and it'll dump it out, it'll pump it through here. And so I don't have to do the gravity flush. Now I could still do that, I've got my gate valves down here, I've got my standard gravity flush. But the macerator is something a lot of people really like to use and it's, it's been kind of a special feature for a long time aftermarket, but now we've got them on the Jayco right here. Another great thing on this rig is that it has a removable shore cord. And removable shore cord is special because first of all, nobody's gonna steal it when I'm storing my trailer. And that happens because there's a lot of copper wire and they're quite expensive. But if we put it away, nobody can get to it. The other thing is, it doesn't come out of a hole in the side of my trailer. So if I don't have a hole, there's no way a mouse can run up that cord and get in my trailer. I don't know how mouse get in a trailer, but that might be one of the ways. And you would not have that problem with this setup of a removable shore cord. Got an outside shower, here's a sewer flush. This is a way to keep your tank clean after you dump it, then you can rinse it out. It really makes it easy to care for. You never have problems if you use it. Has both cable and TV hookup right here. Boy, that's snug. There we go. It's interesting, one bib for both. Look at all the storage. Now remember I showed you that we have a booth dinette 
that has a horseshoe shape and it has storage. It's actually got tubbies all the way under here on both sides. You can pull those out from the front. They've even thrown in a little garbage can for you that goes in under your kitchen. So that right there is a quick thumbnail sketch of the Jayco 23 MRB. And remember, the best thing to me about this trailer is I have a lot of choices how I use my interior space without getting real long. It's got the Murphy bed, and that's a full-size queen for you bigger guys. You're going to love that. Your feet aren't going to dangle off the end. So that's it. Thank you very much for watching the video. My name's Matt Elliott. If you have any questions or you'd like to come by, give me a call. My number is 541-954-8495. Thanks for watching. You have a great day.